You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing pros, welcome to the 307th episode of Potty Talk Live. Hey there, I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura. All right, well, we're talking the business of plumbing. All right, so if you're a plumbing business owner, you're in the right place. Mm-hmm. All right, if you want to be a plumbing business owner, you're in the right place. Mm-hmm. If you just think plumbing business would be would be cool to have, you're in the right place. All right, but mm-hmm. hey, if you're looking to have a good time, you're in the right place. All right, join us. Hey, I'm looking forward to uh, tonight's episode. In fact, yes, I- I'm going to throw a little curveball here, so stick around. The others don't. I'm gonna I'm gonna change exactly. it I'm gonna change it up okay. I'm gonna change it up I know you were you were expecting a fastball but I'm I'm gonna throw a curveball okay okay so hey stick around welcome to my world hey if you're watching hey, live I see it's happening if you're watching mm-hmm. live please type live in the comments mm-hmm. let us know that you have joined us live mm-hmm. and if you're watching the replay please type replay hey, so Doug. we know you caught it Boink. and if you're listening to the podcast mm-hmm. you, you know, know what, what to do. do just keep on <laughs> listening all right all right oh. hey. Uh, live okay. right out uh, in Indiana. All right, Indiana, live hey. right out. There we go. Wow, live right out. Um, out of our, of our home state. I All know. right, well, we're Fl- Floridians now. In fact, I'm going right. to bring we're that home. up. We're don't home. don't hate us. Don't be haters. <laughs> because we're Floridians. Okay. Don't. Yes. All, All that. right. Yes. Hey, Josh. Yes. Don't be haters because mm-hmm. we live in Florida and the rest of the country hey, is, is like uh, you know frozen. 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 Tundra. Tundra. Okay. It's crazy. It is. Hey, mate, Glenn. All right. It's not frozen down under. I bet it isn't. What's the All weather right. like down there, Glenn? In fact, that's our question. What's the temp? That's what's the, the question. temp where you are? What's, what's the temp hey, where Gary, you live? Where you live right. right now. What is okay. your temperature? All right. Let, let us know here. Not your body temperature. Because I, that's going to relate to what you're I... Outside I the temperature. Curveball. What? Yeah, your outside yeah. temperature. Your body temperature. <laughs> 98.6. Can you tell we're, we're a little wacky? We we were we went on the boat all day. Feel sorry for us because it was it was a long day on the boat. It was okay. a long day, and we have a sunburn. I know. I got, I got a little burnt. Got burnt. You know. Hey Joseph. Wah. We're a little burnt, and it was it was very windy. And it was it was windy, it but was very windy. But it was beautiful. Hey, Kimberly, but it was beautiful, it was and yes. we're out with um had a we had a we've had a great hey, Aaron, last four days. We have whatever they came. We had Lion's some client Lion. friends. Hey Lenny. Down from Michigan. Yes, clients. Um, Matt, Matt and Jess, Jess Carter. Carter Carter's owners Plumbing. Of, hey, Vincent, owner of right. Carter's Plumbing right. in Detroit. D- Detroit, area. yeah. Detroit well, area. he's taking over Detroit. Yeah. I mean, and so, totally is. but they came down. Of course, yeah. we talked some business, mm-hmm. which, you know, we all, it was fun with that, of course. What am I saying? D- DFW 13, Dallas. Oh. What? Are you breaking records right. down there? That's crazy. Yep. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Minus 10. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Andrew. man. Uh, oh, oh, okay. oh, minus 28. 28. Oh, my goodness. Oh, goodness. Uh, 19, 19 feels, feels like, like four. four. What? Okay, still... I have to look. Two. Okay. Two. two. Oh, my yeah. goodness. What's the line from the movie uh, Planes, Trains, and Automobiles? Uh, yeah. How cold do you think it is? One. One. <laughs> <laughs> right. Wait, I need to see what it is here in Florida. <laughs> Not hating. Need to relocate Not, to Florida. That's, right. That's... Um, It's 74. It's, it's 74 right now. Beautiful. Sorry, Frozen guys. pipes and sewers are great business. Buffalo is five degrees. Yes, oh, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, we're going to be talking Peca, about, uh, I I, I, I about that. I told you. That. Yes. I, okay, that's my, cur- okay. my yeah, curveball's doing. Southern California. Southern right. California. Yes. Okay. So 65. But I bet it feels cold. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, yeah, 40, back to Matt and Jess. 71. 71. He's in Arizona, though. Um, oh, right. No, no. Um, Patrick, San Fran? Well, San... I think Patrick, though, is in right, Arizona okay. right now. So, yeah, I'm pretty... So tournament's still going 71. on. Okay. There's no way. Representing Milwaukee, Milwaukee. Wisconsin, wow. Powerhouse Plumbing. All right, Matt. Good welcome. name. Very, good name. That is a great right. name. Zero. DW. Zero. Zero. Ooh, Zero. Kansas City. Zero Ooh. degrees. Power's been out in Richmond, Virginia, for a couple days. Oh my goodness, because of frozen lines. Guys, I know, man. All right. <laughs> well, you got power down here. Let me run it in. If you ever see, you know, I, hope, I know. Thirty-nine. Ashley in Utah, me, huh? right? In right. Utah. Yeah. Yep. So, um, but anyway, back to Matt and Jess Carter. Had yeah. an amazing time with them. Great time. Went to a couple of fun places to eat. It was fun. I just love. It. I mean, it's just, you know, we never thought this time in our lives that we'd be doing this coaching thing right. and and all that. Mm-hmm. We didn't expect it. Wasn't on our our plan. Our in fact, but it's turned out to be um, better 
I mean, it's been a great surprise. Yes. I mean, Very just, I mean, yeah, we love it. Relationships. Right. Mm-hmm. And so we get, we get the opportunity to share, you know, I always wanted to share and that's what, uh, you know, I, that's why we're doing this is basically tell you everything and what not to do. Yeah. You know, I don't want you to make all my mistakes, <laughs> you know, and, and so we get to do that in the coaching side, mm-hmm. but a weird thing that we didn't quite have expect, it's not weird, but mm-hmm. become friends. Yeah. Become so close. You yeah, know, I mean, we didn't ex- you know they're everybody's kids and they're right. Their staff and everything, but yeah, it's fun. So it's been a great time. I don't know if Matt and Jess are watching. They're still they're still here. They unfortunately have hey, to go back, back to Michigan tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow um, to like I think he said are eight inches of snow or something oh that they're expecting. I know that's like, gonna be oh. that's gonna be like a shock to their yeah. system. But anyway, Matt and Jess, if you're watching, thanks for hanging out with us. Had a great time. Yep, yep. great time. A lot of fun. Mm-hmm. Had some down a couple of weeks ago. Mm-hmm. You know, and that way some Got more, more coming down. In another few weeks. More fun times. We gotta rest up. I know we do. <laughs> <laughs> they wear me out. Because we're really quite boring people. Right. So. <laughs> we, we really are. And Jess are like, yep, that's, they're pretty boring. Fun. Yep. <laughs> anyway, but it was fun. Very fun. Yeah. Freezing at 65. Yeah. Vincent, I know. Yeah, you're used to. <laughs> I'm sure that does right. be cold in Southern it, California. Well, it might be, is it a wet 65? Maybe. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I never got, you know, uh, just because it's like a damper, it's what feels mm-hmm. colder. Yes. The whole. Well, yeah, like in Indiana, it's, it right. always felt cold because it was always damp. Yep. So, hey, Jessica, Applicant Pro. Applicant Pro, Jessica. The pro from Applicant Pro. Yes. Um, South Jersey, Bob Ryan, South Jersey. All right, welcome. Yeah, welcome. welcome. Glad everybody check in. Yep. Awesome, awesome to hear from everybody. Okay, yeah. Million Dollar Plumber, you're changing well, things up. I just changed okay, it up. Just for the record, I, last minute, we had... Sparky had his whole show together. Everything was all put it was, together. You did a great job, man. You did a great job, Sparky. <laughs> and you know? now we just started just threw him. He's like, okay, uh, <laughs> okay. We're like, just right. just go with it. Yep. So, we're well, we, we, well, what we have happening right now mm-hmm. this is right now, and I think this is a good good topic, even for those I know people people listen to this, you know, Later. The, this summer. Okay. But even when we're we're talking about frozen pipes. I mean, everything mm-hmm. is. Um, you know, frozen right now mm-hmm. and, and dealing with that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. And it just made me think back to really one of the biggest mistakes I made. Mm. And do you remember? I know you know a lot of mistakes, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so I know you right, I know you down, gotta go through all that. <laughs> but the, it has to deal with this mm-hmm. okay. our plumbing business yeah, exactly in the about. wintertime, mm-hmm. early. And um, do you remember? I so remember, remember. What, do you yeah. remember what month? February. February. Mm-hmm. What is that? It turned out to be our biggest. We ran more calls more than calls. we did in the whole we were history of our company. So busy. I Such mean, busy. it was a million calls. A yeah. million calls. One point five million calls. But it was a record mm-hmm. low month. Hey, Danny Penn. Back to the times. It turned out to be a month. Mm-hmm. That back when I was just in the truck, kind of mm-hmm. a month. Yeah. That kind of thing. Yeah. I don't know how it happened. Mm-hmm. Well, I do know mm-hmm. it's just a weird thing. And I'm exaggerating a little bit. But it was a but it was a very very low month. <laughs> And with I all the calls, I, I'm talking here. <laughs> what? what are you doing? I know you. Their their attempts and stuff up. Oh, right. oh I know oh, you don't like the cold. cold. I don't. Gosh, that's why we're here in Florida. I couldn't. I couldn't take another. Guys, one. You, there's sacrifice to be made. When we're going to make a, this change in our life, I wanted to be a cowboy. I wanted to move to Jackson Hole, and and buy the little ranch, you know, uh-huh. and do that kind of thing. Yeah, that wasn't. All happening. right. <laughs> it wasn't it was shot down. She'll be happening. You'll be there by yourself, <laughs> sleeping with the horses. You know. So. And now we've got clients out in Wyoming and, um, gosh, where else? It's cold. Minnesota. Yeah, yeah we're not going to Minnesota. Yeah. I know that for a fact. So Wyoming at least has some. Mountains but we did. So no, anyway. you said no. You said we're Sorry. moving to Florida. Yes. Whatever. We're moving we're, to Florida. Well, I, want, I want to be on the water. Mm-hmm. So need, so I, I sacrificed. Hot. You know. Oh, that's so. And so nice I put up with the water and the, I know. you know. Thank you, honey. Yeah. That's hey, amazing. It's, You're it's the what best. I do. I'm a giving guy. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh-huh. So, so here we are in Florida. So here so, we are okay, in Florida. I won't, I won't, I'll pay attention to you now. Okay. I don't know how we went down that. Well, because I was looking at all the oh, junk and stuff okay. that across. See, so, okay. Took me off. I, I do we still have any viewers right now? Everybody leave? <laughs> no, I don't know. Right. They're okay. all frozen. What the heck are they doing? They're stuck in their house. What else are you going to watch? Right? Okay. But yes. that was the biggest, one of the biggest mistakes I made. Mm-hmm. Which was in February. In February, mm-hmm. okay, mm-hmm. where we ran, we ran all these, all these uh, frozen mm-hmm. pipe calls. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> okay, but what, what happened was, first of all, we kind of ran through the calls, mm-hmm. okay, 
Yeah, because there were so many. <laughs> and we wound up, we didn't charge. In fact, that month, my the average ticket turned out to be like $136. Oh. Now, that's back in a time when I was ch- you know, charging $225 an hour. Oh, wow. You know, uh-huh. and a little. Okay, stop texting she's, she's, us. Whoever's texting she's, us. No. See, it's one of the clients. Leave me alone. Okay. No, right. oh. okay. So. Yes. So we had tons of calls. Tons, had, had of, tons calls. of calls. And let, and let me ask you a question. Is everybody else, I'm assuming, every um, plumbing business owners, you're getting tons of frozen pipe calls right now. Right. You're going to make that assumption. Right. Um, and we actually did see one of our clients, BJ Tiarina of Route 66 Plumbing out of Amarillo, was on the evening news. They interviewed him yeah. for Texas is God's of, country. Speaking of the, the yeah. angel, <laughs> yep. Tiarina, BJ. Um, yeah, he was on the news where they interviewed um, him for talking about frozen pipes and what right. to do. You're letting consumers know what to do. And look good. I'm going to say this because they're not my neighbors. I mean, I'm, I don't live there, so I don't, I'm not worried about offending anybody. Mm-hmm. But it's a great, great example. Okay. He had first they had his company, mm-hmm. uh, Route 66 Plumbing, Route 66 Plumbing mm-hmm. and then another company. We've been there, so I, I get, we actually got we, to we see to Amarillo, Amarillo mm-hmm. where they're at, right? right. And uh, and so this is kind of the big, you know, the big company, the big guys in town. Right, so the local news interviewed two different plumbing companies, right. Route 66 Plumbing Company, the up-and-coming right. plumbing company, and another company, we're not going to say their name. Right, but that was been, that's been there like forever. Right. And in fact, a lot of all the guys worked for, in fact, I think BJ was a supervisor. I mean, worked so. his way, yeah. worked with him mm-hmm. before he start, started his own thing. Mm-hmm. You know, so it had that. But here's the difference. What? And just that BJ, and it's not just because I love him, he's one of my, he's one of our clients, mm-hmm. and whatever, that kind of thing. Yeah. He knocked it out of the park. Totally knocked it. Beat. Young, totally young, did. younger guy. Uh-huh. <clears throat> excuse me, younger guy. Uh-huh. You know, whatever that kind of thing. And uh-huh. but he's all dressed up in his gear. Yes, looked amazing. Yeah. Look, looked great amazing. Background. Great, right? Uh-huh. Took the branding seriously. Uh-huh. That the opportunity here. That hey, the potential customers are going to see. Right. Whatever, so let's look good. Uh-huh. You know, not. And so he he looked like a pro. So totally. Route sixty six looks like if you got a, a problem, uh-huh. this is who you want to call. Yes. The other he was guys. And, happy and, and what? I'll let you. Yes. Well, oh, you saw the other guys. And the other what? guy was a goober. Okay. He was just a goober. I thought you said, no, right. <laughs> yeah, he, made, he actually made plumbing look bad. He, he totally made plumbing look bad. But that's Where, the. Right. BJ in, in Route 66 was all about the customer and all about service. Right. So. Right. Like, we do love us some BJ and Christy. Yes, yeah, we, do. we do. You know, and mm-hmm. it's just, um, right. <laughs> it just looks like it's going to be an experience. Yes. You know, uh, a good experience. Yeah, <laughs> you know, sure. I meant that in a good way. You know, like they're going to Disney World or something. Yeah. You know, yeah, the other I mean, they're good. So the other one's like, oh, this is going to be high way to. <laughs> and it was uh, like a dentist. Oh. You get a root canal. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. That was bad. So, beach, yeah. great job. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, I, I guess I'm, we're assuming again that people across the country, um, plumbing company owners, are having you know the frozen, um, pipes. frozen pipes. Okay. Mm-hmm. So I just want to hit. I just want to tell you. I don't want guys um, lose the experience. Um, the opportunity, and that's what okay. I'll speak on here. Don't make the mistake that I made, right. okay? So I'm just going to tell you what I went to and what I just think you should do, okay, okay for what it's worth, mm-hmm. all right? So I'm going to tell you right off the bat, mm-hmm. right off the bat, mm-hmm. that you shouldn't be do any frozen call for under $500. Like mm-hmm. right. it's a frozen pipe call. Mm-hmm. You go, whoa, whoa, I mean, we can't, you know, not, you know, well, wait, how much did you say, million dollars? At dollar least $500, mm. okay? okay, all right? And mm-hmm. your guy's going to be there. He's going to... You know, I'll, I'll explain, okay? Okay. But, and the reason why. Okay. Okay. Nothing less, less than $500. Okay. So just, I kind of write, of course, I was doing this right before about, <laughs> okay. Okay, now why did, why, what was, what were the, you know, reasons well, or whatever? What was my okay. Point? <laughs> well, first of all, and this may, and these, these sound like it's common sense, okay? okay. But just, just hear it out and, right. and, and rethink it, your position on this, on your, on the frozen pipes, if mm-hmm. you're fighting me on the price. Well, it's just a frozen pipe or what? No. No, there's, there's much more going on, okay? okay. First of all, mm-hmm. you're at a time where it's slow going, mm-hmm. okay? For those that you've been through the oh, academy, yeah. okay, mm-hmm. or of course the clients, or maybe you just picked up on it because you hear me talk about it enough, okay? Mm-hmm. The idea, we're selling time, right. okay? You're selling time, mm-hmm. all right? And of course, we explain all that, you know, in right. Right. academy, okay? Yep. Mm-hmm. All right, but uh, you're selling time, mm-hmm. not plumbing, you're selling mm-hmm. time, okay? So now you're at a time when things are going slow. What does Toby say? Toby's saying, um, I thought the pipes thin, um, install all isolation valves in a flat rate price. Prevention for future freeze. Customers love it. 500 bucks a ticket. 
They're smart, they're, Toby. Okay, yeah. no matter how small the, mm-hmm. or how quickly it could go, or whatever. Okay, because Six ninety five. It's uh, all right. It's slow going. Mm-hmm. Okay, you're it's, outside. It's cold. It's already. Mm-hmm. Yeah, probably the roads are icy. Right. Right. Or you're already. Snowy. You're driving. You know, the guys that are driving slower, but mm-hmm. even themselves, the, the guys themselves, it's oh, just yeah. there's a whole the emotion slower, mm-hmm. attitude slower, okay? Well, yeah, and you're all bundled up and in and out of the, the truck and right. layers, and yeah, it's just right. it's slow going. It's, it just is. And it's miserable. Right. It's miserable. It's, uh, I think it was really good what um, Toby had done because it's um, preventing it in the future. Because yeah. now the customers have experienced how awful it is to have their pipes frozen, and they don't want that to happen that. again. So you're providing a service. You're not... You're not um, ripping them off or any of right. those things you're, you're helping them to not have this experience again so good for you toby right it's that. slow going which mm-hmm. you the idea of ripping them off uh, you know led to you know this is just uh, you know a different experience all right mm-hmm. is the idea of supply and demand yeah and actually patrick Basinga just said that did that okay mm-hmm. all right yeah that's that's one of my clients right. one of my students He's very okay. smart. <laughs> 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 you know um yeah. Where was I? Yeah, I, thought, I love the Basingas. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. But supply and demand. Okay. It's just about, you know, <laughs> there's a lot of supply. You have a lot of customers. Okay. Mm-hmm. The cu- you know, the, the, there's, a, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of customers. Okay. Mm-hmm. And, and demand the demand. demand right. Demand, demand, demand's high. Right. Okay. But mm-hmm. you only have so much time right. to sell. And you're already losing time because mm-hmm. things are going slower. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Supply and demand. Okay. So supply and demand. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's, it's Vicky there. Yeah. Okay. Hey, before I forget on Good. this, I want to, we always give you know, our, uh, something away. Sparky? Oh, oh Sparky's right. picking up on me. <laughs> Look at him. See, he's good. All right. He's right with me. All right. Hey, but some of these things that we're talking about, even, you know, um, the, the ideas, okay, the specs, okay? I laid the specs out for you in my uh, Million Dollar Plumber Blueprint, okay? Mm-hmm. Blueprint. There we go. It's a blueprint. So there's these specs. It's kind of fun. How you, but I, Okay? Yeah. But the specs that you need That's to build a... On words. I all right, get it. All right? The specs. Blueprint specs. Uh, okay? The, the specs you need to build a successful, self-sustaining, mm-hmm. all right, and profitable... I mean, it'd be nice to make some money, okay? Crazy. All right, plumbing business, okay? So there we go. Yeah, so Download, type do do? free. Yes. Type free in the comments yeah, or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash free. Uh. Yes, but um, before you go on, uh, thank you, Sparky, for putting what? that. Um, if you want to get notified when we go live, when Potty Talk Live goes live or whenever the Million Dollar Plumber goes live, um, just, type te- not, yes, just type text in the comments right now and you will get notified Whenever we go live, and you'll never miss an episode of Potty Talk Live, because you never know what's going on with Facebook. Right. If you miss an episode, it's a little crazy with Facebook. So, you're going to die. Yes, and this is so true. If you miss right. an episode, you're going to die. Okay. So, anyway, All right. don't miss an episode. Type text in the comments right now. Thank okay. you, lovely Laura. You're so lovely, All right. Daddy. So here, we're getting frozen pipes, okay? Mm-hmm. Frozen pipes, okay. slow going, mm-hmm. you're losing time, mm-hmm. okay? So the reason why I want to charge no less than five hundred dollars. I already have some saying yeah. they're right there. All right, mm-hmm. okay. No matter no matter how quickly or how whatever it goes, mm-hmm. if you pop it in five minutes or whatever, it doesn't, doesn't matter. matter. Okay, doesn't matter. all right, hey, Corey, all right. Supply future, supply right? and demand. Mm-hmm. Okay, supply and demand. There's a lot of demand, not a lot of supply and right. time. You know. Yep. Okay. Mm-hmm. Finally, okay. Mm-hmm. The idea, and th- this is the thing. Okay. This is it. This is it. <gasps> ride the wave. It's okay to ride the wave. <laughs> You know, I, I talk to our, we, you know, our, our my, clients, our clients mm-hmm. you know, hear this all the time. But we talk, you know, about riding the wave, momentum, okay, and how important that is. And, mm-hmm. and you got the wave, and the wave right. also implies there's a high point to the wave, mm-hmm. and there's a low point to the wave, mm-hmm. all right? So, right, you have a chance to hit the high here, okay? There's nothing wrong with that. There's nothing wrong with that. We used to call it um, the buffalo we're running. Yeah, the buffalo running. Mm-hmm. So what does that mean? Uh, well, we could, you know, you don't, the buffalo aren't always running <laughs> so, when they are. so we are it's time to hunt we got it we got to get out there and, and get as much food as we can right. to, to to last us the winter mm-hmm. okay because it's going to be a while till they run again okay and, the and right. so the same kind of concept works for your your business mm-hmm. all right so the buffalo are running all right and uh right you know you're at ride the top the of the ride you want to ride the wave mm-hmm. so you want it you want to be able to charge mm-hmm. what you do because of these it's slower going mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. So, and, 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 you know, again, supply and demand, you're losing time. Mm-hmm. There's only so much time. Here's a chance to really even gain time. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
All right. Do you do? Here's some people may ask a question because I know people that follow us know that we did not work 24 seven. Right. We didn't have after hours. We didn't work, you know, weekends and holidays. In cases like this, where it truly is um, an emergency, um, and you're going to have an awful lot of these types of calls stay open and and provide the service for the customers we we did it was one of the few you know we always that our caveat was or whatever the, yeah, the caveat mm -hmm. where it was um look we do, we have how we don't work holidays weekends on call and do that kind of stuff but there will be times when we got to do what we got to do so we did have times when we had the flooding and that kind of thing right, in indiana we, when we, it would rain a lot we work on the evening we right. work saturday well and there was a lot of basements in indiana so right. a lot of people had finished basements with sump pumps and so yeah so we would we would work if there was a lot of rain that right. came in through the spring. So this was a time, this is a good example of, um, you know, this is one of these times where I would call because that we're going to work. Mm -hmm. We call it a code red, okay? Code so red. which means working. we're working. Everybody's working today, and we were going to work late. So let, you know, let the wife know, blah, blah, blah. Right. And so we, we, we'd work to 9, 10 o'clock at mm -hmm. night. That's one, one of the rare times right. because mm -hmm. of the opportunity okay that riding the wave this is an opportunity yeah. so the buffalo running we want to get as many buffalo as we can okay at our good price right okay <laughs> which i don't know if you said what that was our oh, biggest mistake did you say that yeah okay yeah, yeah. we just didn't charge enough we yeah we didn't that's uh -huh. what it, well the average ticket that's when the average yeah. ticket was down to like 137 mm -hmm. and the average time a guy would spend on a job as we saw that but by, by driving and all that because it right. was usually it was, again it's slower mm -hmm. when I say slow going it's like driving slow the guys are slow because mm -hmm. they're wet they're cold it's, uh, I gotta work right. and we get called a cold red <laughs> you know so, you know so everybody's upset in neighborhoods if you did a lot right. of work in neighborhoods and stuff those are the roads that never got clear so right you're always slipping and sliding through them right, right. Oh, and so, yeah, yeah, we could be pulling some guys out, yeah, and pushing, because I was on, yeah, you know, because oh. <laughs> you know everybody was on deck, okay, with, with the code red, and so the way to solve this problem is move to Florida. <laughs> <laughs> But, but don't bring hey, in New York. Hey, right. Don't bring New York, New York or, or your Minnesota right, right. or California. And all right. that, right. Okay, leave that back there. Come right. the weather and leave the rest of it. Okay, we may shoot you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, okay. <laughs> well, that's going to get me banned yeah, now. Probably. <laughs> right. I mentioned Facebook. We're not right. shooting. Right. No, no, no. Shooting right. Okay. Mm -hmm. That was. Mm -hmm. That yeah. was um, a joke. A joke, right? Remember those, <laughs> right? Yeah. Remember okay. When humor was allowed. Right. Mm. So, anyways. Okay. But on that, with the time, I wanted mm -hmm. I wanted to clarify the thought what okay. I did with my guys because things were go, going so slow and it, it was in a bad mood. No one wanted to be out there. It was freezing. You know, we charged five five something. I don't remember what it was mm. for. Uh, you know, a frozen frozen pipe. Mm. I mean, thaw. Mm -hmm. I mean, thawing a pipe or so whatever. But my guys got, if I remember, somewhere between three and four hours. Mm. We paid piece rate. Yes. So I believe it was four hours. Mm -hmm. So they they were motivated. I mean, got, guys made almost you know weeks pay on, on times like this right. so when they're going. Worth their while. Right. And so they picked up the pace. Mm -hmm. So the guys were getting right. there. It was still mm -hmm. slow going, but they were on the job. You know, mm -hmm. going quicker. Right. You know that kind of thing because they you know they, yeah they'd work maybe an hour hour and a half and I'm getting four hours. Right. And so they'll get to the next one and I'm gonna do this till you know nine o'clock or right. whatever. Because the Buffalo right. Aaron's got a great, great, great question. Um, do you charge more for service fee in these times? What yes. The yes. Good question. No. Yes. Mm, Very good. Mm -hmm. um, so we did. When I said we called the code red, you know, that kind of thing, that means we went into, if you know, um, certainly if you're, we get into this kind of thing in, in the um, academy mm -hmm. and you know, the clients and all that kind of stuff. But we're, you know, we, we ch charge a service call fee mm -hmm. for it, but we waive it if we do any work whatsoever. So $49. Right. Wave it if we do any work, with, but during code red, we would charge a service, a service, An service call, fee. right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. and we didn't waive it. Right, and we didn't waive it. Correct. Okay, mm -hmm. so absolutely, yeah, charge. And depend on how bad later. Well, it was the code red was seventy nine dollars. Mm -hmm. Okay, and it paid the tech an hour. For those that understand, when we talk in the academy, you know, we're talking piece rate and that mm -hmm. kind of stuff. We know what, but it would, it would pay an, an hour travel. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. But we got into after so those calls that we're doing after our five o'clock. That was at our nine one one rate. Right. Our, um, our code nine eleven. Nine eleven. So nine nine one one. So, mm -hmm. 911. so they got um, um, we hours. charged. Yeah, we charged the customer ninety nine dollars mm -hmm. on top of the. Whatever, so they they paid that anyways. Right. That got us out there. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. And our guys got three hours. 
So when they're working later like that, if they're doing frozen pipe, they get three hours for, you know, for the call and then four hours, so they make seven bucks. So mm -hmm. after five o'clock, mm -hmm. guys were getting in good hours times. Right. So you can see what I was, how guys were getting, they could get like a week's pay right. in a day. <laughs> okay, what? Poor clients. Guys, stop texting us while we're on the Yeah, show. okay. It's rude <laughs> of me to be doing this. Okay. Toby, I uh, see, I have um, hmm. off-hour guys working. Oh, okay, many places we can't do maintenance. Calls until um, oh, in the evening. Great way to provide service to my I'm gonna say something customers. Hmm. I'm assuming. Um, so yeah, he's got you know different shifts, and yeah, yep. that, it, that works as well. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. right. But charge appropriately. Charge appropriately. Okay. That that's the thing. Don't make that Don't make mistake. That mistake right. Okay. okay. It's mm -hmm. it's an opportunity. It's okay. All right. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be slow going. Mm -hmm. All right, you will lose time if you don't take advantage of the opportunity to gain time, mm -hmm. which is part of riding the wave. Right. And, it, and it's all right to ride the wave mm -hmm. on the good side this time right. and to, to, to collect for it because it's supply and demand. Right. Okay? Mm -hmm. All right? Yep. All right. Um, <laughs> thanks, Daryl. Thank you, DW. <laughs> thanks, wisdom. All right. Obi-Wan. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wisdom comes from many mistakes. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. All right. Oh, All I right. remember that February, and it was yeah. very, very, it was freezing cold. Yes. Um, I believe the trucks even, because they were diesels, we yeah. issues we had, as well. Right. So. And, you know, yeah, mm. it, it was, I'm just thinking back, you know, how you get, you know, the, the guys are upset. Mm. It's not going to be, you know, it's cold. Yeah. They're going to get wet. Mm. Um, they, got, they got the word that they know they're going to be working until whenever. Mm today yep. and they you know it, so maybe it, buy them lunch or, or do something um that right. kind of gets them through the, the tough times have something back right. at the shop with with some you know sandwiches or soup even right. something warm um, and, pay, and pay them and pay them well and you can do that mm -hmm. um if you, if you if you charge well Correctly. okay mm -hmm. but pay them well because it's an opportunity for them to, to take they they get to win right. with the supply and demand right and having to work under uncomfortable conditions, mm -hmm. and, you know, and above and beyond a normal call, you know. Call of duty. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So pay them well. All right. So okay. there we go. Okay. Don't want you to uh, make the same Fair dumb mistake, mistake right. that I made. You're providing great service. And right. again, like Toby's doing, he's um, helping them prevent future issues. Right. And that's how you serve your customer. That well. is serving your customer. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. There okay. we go. All right. Hey, if you want to, yes. you know, we discussed, I, I've, I've mentioned it a couple times tonight here about the, the, the Success Academy. The Million okay. Dollar Plumber okay. Success Okay. All right. Where you'll learn the business of plumbing. It's all there in my academy. Okay. Hey, if you want to be in a different spot this time next year, yeah. all right, you need to know these things. Okay. Stop coasting. Just coasting along. All right. Let's take off. All right. So check out the uh, Success Academy. You can go to... Success. Million, you can type success. Yeah, type success. All right. Type success. <laughs> or go to. Well, you, you've been changing things. There's some cool <laughs> stuff coming down the road, <laughs> by the way. Okay. It still is the million dollar but, plumber .com yeah. forward slash success. There we go. But Thank you for pulling conference. me out of that one. Yes, you're welcome. Okay. Sweetheart. All right. There we go. All right. Hey, charge for those uh, frozen pipes. Yeah. Okay. Get out there. All right. Yeah. And uh, serve. All right. There we go. Yeah. And as always, before I let you go, I want to remind you that you were purposefully and wonderfully created. Yeah. All right? Yeah, you were, brother. And you were created to do great things. So get out there and plumb like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.